hi welcome back to my channel this is yawa thank you for your support and thank you for passing by as you can see today i'm showing you some bead necklaces and yes so hustling <laughs> if you are interested in any of these products message me thank you my people my people i also want to introduce you to adam's beauty hair product it works for me i've used it for two months and my edges my hair grows so good so message me to this menu let's see <laughs> today i'm making green beans and salmon very nice so here we are these are the ingredients i'm gonna use and almost the whole meal this is the whole meal right here so i'm gonna show you this is green beans i just cut it into two because i don't want it so long and uh this is uh shrimp so you can see already seasoned you know yep um chopped garlic my salmon already seasoned so I put it in the fridge so the season can go in since yesterday. I just took it out. And my veggies. Tomato, green, pepper, yellow, red, and onion. So I have my salt here and my pollo to taste. Yeah, I don't use it often, but sometimes I'm using yeah. it. So this is all we are going to use to make our green beans and salmon. All right, I'm not going to use my oven, but you can use your oven, it's the same. I'm gonna use the fry, uh, air fryer, which you can like, you can do everything. This is for fish, you know, like you can do anything you wanna bake, you know, it's already working. So I'm gonna use this, okay, turn it off. I'm gonna use this for my salmon, okay? next i'm gonna go here i'm gonna boil this for five minutes only i don't want to chew it raw so i'm gonna uh, boil it for five minutes okay i put a lot of salt see guys um i've put uh the salmon on the tray already it's only on the tray so i'm just gonna bake it for 12 minutes on a 400 just boil the green beans for five minutes so it can be crunchy you don't want to chew your right like that so it's five minutes and it's done so i'm gonna keep it on the side and i'm going to start making my um stew for the green beans making the stew with my veggie i'm going to fry this little bit the shrimp before I start frying my um, shrimp, I'm going to, uh, you know, we say turn the oil. Turn the oil. I'm not going to turn my oil with um, onion, but I'm going to turn it with uh, chopped garlic. So, as you can see, I'm going to put a little bit of garlic in it just to turn my oil. The aroma smells so good. And now. Uh, I'm going to start putting my uh, shrimp in it. Removing the garlic, I remove most of it. I'm going to place my uh, shrimp. Yeah. I'm not going to fry it for long. Just, you know. I'm not going to fry it too long. Yeah. Woo! 12 minutes. I'm gonna check it out if it's done. Okay? It looks like it's not done yet. You can see clearly. But I'm gonna use my um, my uh, fork and cut it and see whether it's done or not. Okay? So, let's see. Ooh, it's done, guys. Oh, I 
one is so black so all I did is olive oil heat it a little bit and then I pour my uh, my onion in it because it's together in the fish so you can see some of the things that they so that's all I did that's how I do my I do my stew just wait a little bit, like one minute of the onion to marinate in the oil and then you can pour the rest of veggies in it so all this is going to go now that my veggie and everything is in it I'm going to cover it up for five minutes to cook okay into my chopped garlic on it and then cover it up again for five minutes because the veggie is still raw like not that done the way I want it so I'm going to let it cook a little more but before I cover it, I'm going to put my salt and oil. So, that's my foil. This is what it is, foil. Let's put a little bit for taste and then my salt just a little bit that's enough and then stir it, stir it you can see cooking now I'm gonna leave it again for oh, at least uh, this holding camera thing is hard to man <laughs> Okay, let me give three minutes of cooking and then I can pour my um, trick in it. Alright. So as you can see, it's cooked now. I like it the way it's a little bit soggy. Yeah, that's the way I want it. As you can see. So, I'm going to pour my shrimp Right. Almost done. I need to go fast because I'm going to work. So we'll stir it. You see that? Stir it. And then leave it for two more minutes and I'm going to pour my green beans in it. Alright? And lower the heat or the fire to medium or yeah medium. Okay. So we are almost done. I'm gonna pour my green beans. Do you see that? Ooh, I like that greenish. Mm -mm -mm. So just stir it and we are done. Stir it, stir it. So as you can see, as an African home, there's no pepper in this. So I have my pepper on the side because of my kid. I cannot put pepper in it. So the pepper is on the side. Now if you like to use the pepper, you can take some and pour it on your plate and eat this with salmon. It's a good meal and healthy. You guys know that, you know. You know that you can explain it better than me. Because, you know guys, I came to America to learn English. I don't speak English in my country. We speak French or Ewe or Mina. Yeah. Guys, as you can see, I'm already ready to go to work. I'm running late. I'm just going to chop my food. You see that? You see that? Quick fix meal. We are all about it. <laughs> so, 